Every, everything, everything's working. Oh my god. Do I actually have a fucking stream where everything works right at the beginning? It's been so long since this happened. I haven't had a good start to a stream in forever. Goddamn. Damn. Shit's working. This is so rare. This never happens. It was like once in a blue moon. That freeze was my fault, by the way. That wasn't an issue. Goddamn. Everything's set up. I got a title. I got everything. I forgot to put on fucking socks and shoes. Sorry. That's totally an important part to streaming. Give me a moment. Let me let me just uh, pause the stream for no fucking reason to do that. Uh, don't know my need, people on YouTube, because there's literally nobody here on stream yet. Oh, don't fucking mind me. I'm not doing anything. What are you talking about? Nothing's happening here. I'm not putting on fucking socks so I can wear shoes while I stream, even though you only see the upper half of my body at all times. Even when I stand up. That's not, that's not important. Oh, no, don't mind that. You can just forget about that small little detail while I... Realize I'm gonna have to talk to my wife. I have mail that I didn't check yesterday. I got a lot to fucking do. Actually, maybe that mail, it's Sunday. That's probably telling me about the flower dance, right? The fucking flower dance. Bro, I'm gonna dance with my wife. Let's fucking go. I actually got shit to do in the game for once in a fucking million years. Ooh, no, I don't mind if she does redecorating. Am I not? I can't, I can't kiss my wife. Fuck game. No, fuck the weather report. My wife won't fucking kiss me. What the fuck is this shit? Pumpkin. Oh, yeah, it's probably because I maxed up my relationship, so I don't want to, like, start fucking feeding me extra points for no reason, because it's just a waste of talking to my wife. Let's see. Oh, Pierre. Hit it. I have sashimi. The top coin forever brings it. Top coin for sashimi? Bro, bro, I just have had that shit sitting in a chest for like months. <laughs> Not really, I've had it for like a month and a half in game. Or water. Sort of fucking got. I just fucking started and I'm already having a fucking skill issue. God fucking damn it, I held it too long. I can't hear the motherfucking sound of the goddamn. This is why the music stays down. Rat and Joy told me to turn the music up and keep it up for a while. I know it's there, it's just really fucking annoying when I'm doing shit that doesn't deserve music. Cause then it gets in my fucking way constantly and it's fucking stupid. Well, at least I have coffee. If I turned the lid right, I could show you the fucking coffee. No, I couldn't because you're fucking essentially blind on 720. You don't know what's on my fucking cup. For all you know, that cup says... I'm not gonna say it. No, what could I say? I don't know what I can reasonably say here. Make fun of myself and do other things at the same time. I might want to move the position of my camera, because I'm leaning really far this way, and yet I'm still in the center of my fucking... My camera's here. I'm over here. <laughs> and yet I'm in, like, the fucking center of the camera. I gotta reposition that shit. What can I sell? Beans. Not the coffee beans. Coffee beans stay, but beans can go. Alright, I can start fucking- I can actually do shit? Oh my god. I haven't touched those fucking things in like... Forever. Uh... My wife fucking- Fuck it, move the fireplace so I can talk to her. That's... Put the fireplace back, that's not... Not the time for that, Abigail. Not the time and place on stream. This is gonna be a very boring. Actually, all of this is just really boring. Ugh, fucking damn, boring. Don't mind that. I don't mind the voice crack. Don't mind the slight voice crack. It's like the fucking, it's like the video of the kid who's fucking playing basketball and he says, "Don't mind my voice crack," or like ignore the voice crack and then goes, "You suck!" and sounds like a fucking goose. I love that fucking video so much. Really wish I could. I knew how to fucking find it, but I can't. What was I doing? I had something. I was good. What can I? What can I make you? Gold. Wasn't there something? I was looking for something in my crafting menu and I forgot what it was instantly. Hello? Keg. Oak resin. I need oak resin. Wife. No, not that. Why is she looking at a fucking chair? Why did she- st what the fuck? Why did she stand next to the fucking- she just chooses for no reason to stand next to the TV and look at the side of it. 
I don't understand this woman. I'll never be able to understand the strange mind that is a woman's mind. I'll never be able to understand the strange place. I was not intending to give her gold. She would have fucking beat me. I, I would have been domestically abused by my wife if I gave her gold right there. But that's how it would have felt with how fucking mean she'd have been. Damn. Hand shingled. I was about to do something. I'll go over here, right? A lot of stuff goes over there, apparently. Goddamn. I have no fucking- what? What the fuck happened to my- Where'd my fucking seaweed and kelp grow? Or algae? My fucking seaweed and algae dipped. They're gone. I had so much of it. Alright. Okay, well, you know, there's two things. There's two things I could spend my time on right now in game. I could spend my time in the mines to get mining levels and stone and all that. Or I could spend my time fishing, but I'm probably not going to fish because I'm... Why am I at 80,000 again? What did I make that much money off of? I fished for like a day, two days, and I only made 2,000 off of one of them. And I sold something for like 5k. That is the most that I did. And yet, magically, fucking magically, back up to 80k. Makes no sense. Also, Pierre, it's Sunday, so this works out. Pierre wants sashimi. So Pierre shall get sashimi. Because I, I found it in a trash can. I'm pretty sure. I was rummaging through the, through the trash, and I was just like, oh shit, that's sashimi. And I've had fucking fish on a plate for weeks. This shit probably smells like death's asshole. Like, go fuck yourself, Shane. I'm not going fishing. Pierre, sashimi. It's about time I was starting to get the shakes. I wanted to fish so bad. Munch. That shit's been sitting in a Luke in a room temperature box for since winter. It is almost the end of spring. Oh yeah, I need to talk to Lewis. You aren't Lewis. Wrong old man. I also need to talk to Emily to keep my relationship with her up. Louise. Ah, Finny, so you helped us with our slime problem? Thank you. Hope you didn't go through too much trouble. No, it can be re it can be really hard to get that sticky slime out of your clothes. We talking about we talking about those fucking monsters in the dungeon? Definitely ruined a few good pair of pants trying to catch those little squirmers. I can remember Papa going into the going into a rage after I got a bright orange slime all over my brand new twill pants. Hello, Bebop. What's up? Reward? What the fuck did he give me? Goddamn, that's fucking nothing. Why do I keep accepting these quests for, like, no money? I'm fucking loaded. This is like dropping fucking- This is like dumping a cup of water into the ocean when I get money for these quests. Like, I've, I've kind of amassed my own fortune. I need to go look at the name of an achievement real quick. Millionaire. So millionaire isn't even, like- It's not even a reward your grandpa checks for on year three. If I remember correctly, so your grandpa sees you with a million dollars after three years, just three years of working, you're an actual millionaire, and you're just like, okay. Who asked? You're like, fuck it, I don't. It's a million fucking coins! This motherfucker just looks at you and just walks away. He just fucks off. If I had a son and he became a fucking millionaire in three years with my land, I'd be fucking questioning how shit I was at using said land. Why am I here again? I want rubies, that's why. Well, and, you know, this 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 stuff works too. Can't these guys see me through walls? Yeah. I'm about to get hit with weakness by these guys. I wonder if they can stack it, please, for the love of fucking god. I uh, can't hit him. I just need the guy who can actually do damage dead. Oh, shit, exit. Nothing else here. Nothing else here. Yeah, I'm just gonna be having to spend all of my time for the rest of this fucking game on the same couple of fucking die. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. Because I reached the end point where all that's really left is the community center and working on bundles and amassing wealth. But to amass wealth, I have to do all the things that I've already been doing. No, what I can do- that's a diamond. 
or an Aquamarine, one of the two. What I can do is try to get all my skills up to 10, which I'm not too far off of. I need to do more combat stuff. I just realized there's two bats, aren't there? I heard flap flap in the distance, and I still- there he is. Why are you so fucking slow? He looks like a crab, because you can't see the bottom half of him. That's like really dark when he's in the black area of the void. Is there anything left I would missed somehow? Like a bat up this way. Because I really don't want to just have to fucking break rocks till I get to the next level. No, it helps with my mining level. And I need thousands of stone for something that I'm doing, so... May as well. How much do I need? I need... 2,500 stone for what my goal is. Fuck two. Immediately, right off the fucking bat. Luckily I have a decently fast weapon. Okay, it didn't fucking matter because they perfectly timed when they ran in. I swear to fucking god. Please, please, for the fucking god, not that guy. Not that guy with other guys. That is the main issue here. This guy does fucking ass loads of damage. Bats? Manageable. They do like 10 damage. That motherfucker, doesn't he do like... Can't he do like 25 on the high end? His damage can fucking go up there. And he's really... He doesn't fucking get knocked back either. He fucking just... He keeps running. You kill... You fucking swing at him. He gets hit in the face with a fucking sword. A sword forged from fucking lava. And he just walks away. Or no, he doesn't walk away. He just keeps walking. He walks in the exact same direction. He doesn't even turn around to walk away. Because, yeah, fuck that. No, he just keeps running at you. How the fuck do you get smacked in the face with lava and keep walking? Actually, what is the sword even made out of? It was forged in a pool of churning lava, so that means that it's a fucking material that requires lava to be forged. Do you know- do you understand how hot lava is? It's a little fucking hot. If a material needs to be forged in lava, that shit's gonna fucking hurt. And this motherfucker just looks at me like the fucking- when- <laughs> what, what, what was it? It was when the woman I'm chasing hits me with that dollar store pepper spray and he's just fucking standing there. It's the exact same fucking thing. I fucking remember that. It was one of those things that happened. Like, there were a lot of fucking memes made about it. That's a crab. Why do crabs drop bombs? Crabs are terrorists? I mean, I'm not surprised. That's coming at me. There's two shit. I should have stayed where I was. Dead. There's nothing else here. I just want some good shit. I just realized I'm about to be on level 15. 115, sorry. Big difference, 115 and 15. They're well known in our community. Okay. Can't tell how I'm supposed to take that joke. I don't know if that's based on crabs being terrorists or the fucking chasing after women thing. A little late to both. up some bats. Into the wall. Into the wall. I actually got his stuff through the wall because of how goddamn long my pickup range is. Two bats. <laughs> Fuck off. Three bats? Fuck. No, it's only it's only two bats now. Fuck, I was gonna say it's only one now because I killed two, but then another fucking one appeared. My health is getting a little low. I'm having a serious skill issue as I go on. Mushroom. Purple mushroom. Fuck! Not the fucking slime with them. Like, come the fuck on. I- I do 211 on a crit sometimes. 16 and that. It's really hard to fucking gauge where an enemy's, like, damage box is when they fucking- 
when it it's their shadow. Their shadow is their hitbox, not their fucking sprite. Amethyst, that's useful. Oh wait, there's gold right fucking there, and I thought I just walk past it. My energy's getting a little low, and it's late. I should probably go home after this level. Please don't fucking join forces, because minus eight defense when this motherfucker can already like half kill me. I I don't think I'd survive for very long. That would take me like two fucking seconds to die. I don't have the immunity band, so if I survive the first hit, I'm more than likely not gonna survive the second. Also, yeah, purple mushrooms are rare. I just don't seem to believe that for for some reason. For some reason, uh, some small reason. Unless she meant it was rare to be given as a gift on a star feast, which is just Christmas, but you eat a star. Which, funnily enough, technically works because the star feast thing is meant to be connected to the star drops, which are a alien living fruit thing that you eat. Give you more stamina. I guess... Feasting on stars is applicable. You know, if you get really lucky, that is. So yeah, my energy is fucking insane. I've had like what two or three of them. I've had a lot of star fruit so far. Star drops, I think they're called. Now, star fruit is the really cheap one. Well, cheaper one. I think you buy their seeds for like a fucking lot. One sixty-four. My inventory full. Alright, well, my inventory's full. Good to know. I can go put the mushroom with the others. Yeah, for some reason, I just don't think purple mushrooms are that rare. Like, you know, just for some reason. I don't know what gives me that idea. I have another rusty spoon. Am I going to be able to stack rusty spoons now? No, I'm not. It does belong in here, though. How do I have more bat wings and slime? Seems a little wrong. Another explosives to put away. Geodes. The geodes didn't go in here? Oh, I didn't have any. I'm gonna open geodes tomorrow then. No, not the fucking pumpkin! Okay. I have 13 diamonds. God fucking damn. Yeah, so few rubies. You caught a fever? Damn. How bad of a fever? Like, do you feel like you're fucking dying, or are you just, like, chilling, but you feel like you want to not move? Like, how horrible is it? Wait, how much gold do I have? I'm gonna have 24 at the end of that. Then I'll start doing that instead, so I'm only gonna make one more... Gold ingot. I wonder if it's gonna rain tomorrow. Because if it rains tomorrow. You're die okay. That's uh are you taking a lot of meds? A lot of different like whatever you take when you're sick. <laughs> Wife, woman. It's pumpkin time. Well, actually, no it isn't, not yet. Let me just hold something I won't give to her. Going to town today, just so you know. I need to stretch these legs a bit. Mwah. Now it's. Never mind. You don't. You don't need pumpkins. Your relationship smacked out. You don't get pumpkins anymore. I've loved this woman so much. She doesn't get gifts from me anymore. I didn't grab the iron ore, did I? I did. I saw it in my inventory. My brain went. That's not what I should be, and tried to tell me that I hadn't already picked it up. I keep hitting the wrong fucking set of double buttons on my controller. I keep hitting my bumpers instead of my fucking triggers. Did I actually take more water to water more area? Didn't take any. Well, you should probably fucking do that. Like, at the very least, some kind of fucking, I don't know, ibuprofen. What, what's it called? Uh, acetaminophen, I think, is one of them. Yeah, acetaminophen is the active ingredient in most things. My immune system should work as he should. Yeah, your, your immune system should work 
Doesn't mean it's gonna. So you're usually supposed to, like, help it a little, just a tiny bit. I didn't go see Merlin yesterday, fuck. Okay, I'm gonna go... Oh, I'm gonna get here way too early. But I also did so much shit that now I've wasted enough time that if I went to Merlin... No, even if I went to Merlin, enough time would pass that... Or not enough time would pass that Emily would leave her house. And Clint would be open, so like... Damn, that shit. Fucking seven months? Damn. Maybe you should start, like, helping it. Because, like, some people just aren't born with a naturally very strong immune system. If you're one of them, you should probably be taking something that your immune system will, like, like. Because, you know, if, if your immune system don't work, you don't just say, weak Bitch, you actually try to fucking help it, or you die. Never left the house. Damn. That was me my sophomore year. Uh, the whole online school shit. Never had to move. It was heaven. Oh. I wish Halo would get a job or at least contribute to cooking and cleaning. I think she's hoping to marry someone rich. What crazy in that time? You go crazy because you don't leave the house for a long time, or you went crazy because like you were sick and felt like you were dying the entire time. Because I've never understood going crazy from not leaving the house. I like. I very rarely leave my house. I am home alone, or not even home alone, I'm just alone quite often. My inventory is full enough for this, right? Yeah. The odes. I'm like built for being quarantined. Uh -huh. Actually, I've already donated that, I'm pretty sure. Am I gonna get anything good out of this? That's okay, I guess. Fuck you. I'll bag it. Nice. Okay. Okay. I, I already have plenty of those. What? One ore. What was that? Okay, well, I guess. Thank you. I never upgraded my fucking hoe, did I? No, I did not. Probably should, because as the seasons start going by, I'm going to want to plant a little more. No, I guess I haven't given this to him yet. I don't I, yeah, I picked up a new book recently, because I dig in worms. The worms hold our books. Alone in your room, no one's allowed to be near me, and all I had was my phone to entertain myself in those months. That sounds like my normal life. Well, besides this, I tend to only be on my phone. And if I'm near people, I'm mostly alone at the same time. Like, you know, but again, sophomore year. That's my fucking sophomore year. Until my phone got taken, and then I had literally nothing except school to do. And I still wouldn't do it, so I had nothing to do. Secrets of the Lingerie Fish. Fishermen speak of five rare and unique fish that can be caught by skilled anglers. Once caught, they will never appear again. Crimson fish lives in the warm ocean waters in the summer. It's been sighted on the far eastern side of the beach. The glacier fish, which only appears in winter, can be caught off the southern tip of the Arrowhead Island in Cinder Sap Forest. Southern tip of the Arrowhead of Arrowhead Island in Cinder Sap. I don't know what the fuck that means. Near where the river meets the ocean. Oh, okay. The anglerfish has been spotted in fall, north of the town where the river flows down from the mountains. So, yeah, probably there. There's a rumor of a strange twisted fish that lives in the sewer. Understandable. Final fish of species never been... The final fish of species never caught before is known simply as legend. It is rumored that he lives in a log submerged in the mountain lake 
and only ventures out on rainy spring days to nibble at the frog's eggs. Only the most, most skilled fishermen can hope to catch this one. Train at fishing and be persistent and eventually you will catch these elusive fish. Make sure to respect the water and don't remove too many fish from the ecosystem. A yikes from me. It's definitely a yikes from me. I've removed I've removed the human population from the ocean, honestly. <sighs> so that means it's spring. So there's literally nothing in spring. Wasn't that what it said? It said there was one south there in the lake and the one that can be caught. There's literally nothing for the spring, is there? comes out on rainy days, but it doesn't say spring. No, it did say spring, right? The legend is a spring fish. Maybe. I don't know. Yeah, again, uh, surviving with, uh, no people. Is what I was built for. Nothing better than it. I'm not a very social creature. I live in the basement. I'm in the dark at almost all times. My most, the most social aspect of my day is stream for three hours. With just a phone, I will s actually, with just a phone, I can pull all nighters like three nights in a row. The kind of shit you can do on a phone without leaving bed is insane. It's not copper. Very low on that. I don't need it right now, apparently. Okay. I'm a fucking shut-in. Like the definition of a shut-in. Leave one asked to leave my house. Other than that, I live in my room at all times. I have nowhere I want to go. Most of- mostly. Staying home is the best place to be at all times. And the thing about your phone is, given your phone, you can just interact with people on that. If you need a real person to socialize, then the modern age has failed you. Also, considering you're here, that can't be true. Anything about my future, if you were to say them, could be catastrophic. Eight. Almost maxed out. Maybe we should just start work on more relationships and only focus on that for a while. No, because I need to raise my levels. I'm going to plant an island filled with fucking trees and just wait a while. And as soon as they're all grown, go fucking wild. Which would allow me to do the whole oak resin thing. Something did something, and I don't know what that something was, or what something it did. Oh, it's this, okay. Right, put shit away. Ah. Uh, <laughs> fucking still remember that quote, because Abigail's gone, which means that she's at the fucking... She's in the town. I remember the quote that from fucking Carolyn where she was like, you know, dinner's gotten real cool. Uh, no. Talk at the dinner table has gotten real quiet. Something like that. Something about dinner being quiet with Abigail not around. And then she was like, no, not because she chews their mouth open. <laughs> Insulting her own daughters for no fucking reason. It's hilarious. Let me go check my fucking... Let me go check my fucking cave for mushrooms. Purple mushroom. That makes what six that I have now. Hold on, those are oak trees, right? No, they are not. The leaves are too close together, or too spread apart. Sorry, it's the other way around.
One, two, three, four, one, two. I'd be really fucking upset if that could crush my shit. Do I have any trees left on my fucking property? I don't think I do. Now, next time I play this fucking game, I am not picking the goddamn river island. This shit is annoying. Rusty Spur. Fuck happened that is in your top three most painful moments. Uh, well, what happened? Well, what what did I? What is this stream forever going to hold in history? I'll leave those. Oh my god, a train is passing through Stardew. So wild. I don't know if that means anything, because I really don't give a shit. But you know. You need it? E okay. Yeah. Reasonable. Uh, just imagining it makes me fucking wish I didn't have knees in general. Can I fix this fucking house? Is that an option? Need to put it back in place. Whatever this once was, it's now in ruins. There are also maple trees. What the fuck? Right. Yeah, these are maple trees. <laughs> the exact same fucking sprite. <laughs> Two, three, four. Fuck just... God, what the fuck are your joints if that can just happen by itself out of fucking nowhere? I just tip a tree on my house. Fine. I don't know if I get any closer. Yeah, I do get slightly closer if I do this. Mines is the closest. Oh, I should have gone the other way. That would have been like probably about the same trip, honestly. Minus the whole down section I got to do here. Also, I've seen the train before. It didn't drop shit. It just went by. And I already missed it. The train doesn't last very long. By the time I see the train has arrived thing, there's like 20 seconds. That I'll, or like 10 seconds, I'll be able to see the fucking train once I get here. I saw the train was here once, and then I instantly fucking ran for the train. There's not a... Jack shit. Just pass by, not doing anything. I tried interacting with it, trying to get into the door, hitting it with an axe. Nothing happened. But it was cracked, and that apparently meant nothing. Honk. No oak trees on my property. So what I'm gonna go do is um, I have a couple saplings. I don't know what the point of mahog in a mahogany tree is. Does it grow during a certain season? Oh, but it's going back here. It's going away from everything else. Which island will be? This is going to be the tree island. I'm going to start it right here. Yeah, I don't give a shit. They're planted like this. Yeah, because I can still go up here and around this way. Something were to be here, I wouldn't be able to get past this gap. So that means that I can do here and here, and that means that I can do here. Like an oak tree island. Actually, maybe not that one. These few are gonna have to move. I think you as well, because I don't want to like lose it to the water or anything. Good enough, alright. Then I'll just do the pine cones over here. These ones can be planted with a lot less 
care. Mind the gap right there or anything. It's not important. Don't I have another kind of seat on me? Yeah, I have these. Okay. Okay. All my seeds are planted. All my saplings are planted. Don't don't mind don't mind my beautiful configuration. No need to applaud me for how brilliantly I placed all of those. Where's my fucking wife? It's 9.30. Will she teleport home? Nope, where the fuck is she? I lost my wife. There's my wife. Speak. Speak, my wife. Speak. Speak to me. Tim. My wife don't want to talk to me. Ooh. That's not my wife in bed. <laughs> well, it wasn't my wife out there. One of them's not real. Right. Damn it, no rain. Still got a water shit. You, woman. That's not a woman. <laughs> I hope you've been practicing your moves. Tomorrow is the flower dance. I have not, but I will do my best. This is just saying, hey, flower dance, bitch. Eh. Damn, voice crack. Tomorrow, we're all getting together for the flower dance. If you can find a partner, you might even want to participate in the dance yourself. There's a little clearing beyond the forest west of the town where we hold the dance. Arrive between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. if you're interested. Okay. One, two. One, two, three. One, two, three. I just need to figure out what the fuck game I'm gonna play after this. I never fucking put a list of the games that I have access to in the Discord or anything. There's a lot of trees. I'm now realizing how fucking long it's gonna take to break all of them once they grow. Do you need to water these? No. Getting to the gym? Hell yeah, bro. The fucking games. Dude, I need to start working out again. I can literally see my fucking dumbbells staring me down from outside my door. I'm just looking at them. They're, they're just looking back. Yeah, I've been neglecting my fitness a little bit. A little bit too much. I keep thinking about doing it, and then I just don't do it. it doesn't happen. Makes me feel bad about myself, you know? How's the, mono the, the mahogany? I was about to say monogamy. How's the monotony going? How much? 55 kilograms? 55 kg to pounds? That's... 121? It's, yeah, I can see that. 55, 183. So you're exactly six feet tall. Okay, keep in mind, I'm what, like, I'm like six centimeters shorter than you. Six centimeters. It's a six centimeter height difference. Like, a two inch height difference. At like two, not even three cent fucking inch height difference. I weigh 160. I mean, not actually 160. I think my most recent had me at like, Maybe 150? I haven't checked in a while. I can check that from my fucking phone because of my scale app. I'm already logged in. And yeah, it's telling me to log in. Aren't you already able to use Bluetooth? Oh, because it's got it needs to be able to do. Never mind. Yeah, I'm like 149 right now. Fucking Bebop 
weighs 40 pounds less than, or 30, 40, 30, 40 pounds less than me. And is two inches taller than me. I mean, at least you don't have any fucking fat on you. I got, I got my fair share of, like, fat sitting on my bones. Maybe not much on my arms. It's hard to show off that, but, you know. You are short. We, we already know this. Yeah, zero fat. I'm, like, 15% body fat. I think I have, like... This is a fucking... This is new. Alright, um... Can I, I, this isn't what I want to see. Can I just... Can, can I just... Can I see the old thing? Please? There it is. Okay, so... At the time, I weighed 149... And at 130 pounds of body weight, uh, uh, fat-free body weight. I have 13% body fat, or had 13% body fat. This isn't exactly a new measurement. This is from, like, two weeks ago. And my diet and exercise have severely changed in two weeks. Well, actually, the exercise hasn't. The diet has. I still haven't been working out since that time. So, really, my only bulky things are my arms. Anything to do to yeah, I do. Talk to the people and give them gifts and shit. Takes me less than a year to get eight hearts with a village with a person, as I learned with um Abigail. So if I were to get eight hearts with everybody, the consistency with talking to them would kill me, but the gifts would probably fucking drop me on my ass in work. Nose itches. I'm fucking edge of it. Four point one percent. God damn. Yeah, fabulous gift. So. Yep. Oh hi. I see to visit me like this. Yeah. Yes, it is. So four point one percent of one hundred and twenty. Twenty percent of four. It's a fifth of four, which is like what seventy-five. Around eighty. I'll just go chuck in. 4.1% of 120. That gets you 4.9, so... That's 5 pounds of fat on you. I have about 19 pounds of fat on me. Slight difference. Very slight difference. I have almost 20 pounds of fat on my body. Then again, a lot of that is visceral. Or is it visceral? I don't know. It's either vis- No, I think it's subcutaneous. There's a difference between the two. Ah, never mind. So, that means that the majority of my body fat is in... Visceral, which is what surrounds your organs, I think. No, never mind. Excellent. No, never mind. I guess it is my subcutaneous. Yeah, no, I'm mostly subcutaneous. So, I have a lot of fat stored in my skin, according to my fucking skin. Because based on your size, that is calcul- What the fuck? Oh, okay, that's what it's saying. I'm 82.7% muscle. You know, my... Bone mass is... That... Oh. You know, if you have a fucking heavy-ass skeleton, then good luck. Also, it's measurable. If you knew how far along the field of science has come in the many years since we started measuring people's health. <laughs> it's insane what they can do nowadays. I mean, if I had more of my biometrics, like, available to my scale, it would give me even more accurate readings. These are, like, a little off. But my scale literally shoots a fucking signal up my leg. Like, an electric sig- very weak electric signal up my leg. And then when it goes down through the other foot, and when it comes down through my other foot, it uses the readings off of that signal to figure out what I am. So it can measure body fat and shit. It's insane. It's got a margin of error, but like, it is pretty fucking accurate. Yeah, I, I've already been in your basement. Actually, important question. Um, how accurate is Renfo? 
Ren. How accurate is a Renfo smart scale? So, yeah, it's very accurate. So, it's not even super far off. So, wait, what does this say? Six months back, use it every morning. Yeah. So, yeah, so it has like a 1% margin of error. So, I guess that is what I am. Damn, I have more muscle than I fucking thought. And again, it is mostly in my chest. I have a fucking very built chest, but a very undefined to most other things. Worms. Like, you know that, that bit of rippling that you'll see in bodybuilders' chests right down the center? How they have that, like, right on the sides where they have definition? It'll have, like, the little lines, like, indents down it. I have a couple of those. Not, like, actually bodybuilder level, but, like, you know. They're there. I don't know what causes those. Also, my chest fucking pops, which is weird. Like, you know how you can go to crack your back and, like, you'll do this with your arms when you go to do it? I That can pop my fucking center chest, and it's wild. That's understandable. I mean, legs are one of the more important things. Again, you, you fucking walk on them, so... No, my legs are okay. I gotta train them more. I don't really do enough with them to have them built, but I still want them built. Do I have anything in-game to do right now? Gifts. Community center. Can't do anything with the community center right now. I'm already working on everything that I can. I talks to Merlin. What are your favorites? I don't know your favorites yet. You? Pumpkin pie. I can't get you that. Haley. All doable. Lewis. Not very doable. Sandy. Easily doable. Ignorance is a gift. It, it is, generally. I started a fucking diet because I thought I was like, slow. no, I didn't even start a diet because I thought I was too high fat. I did once and I was like, you know, I, I'm fine, eh, you know. No, now I do a diet whenever I do end up doing it, literally just to see if I can. Not much more reason than that. I'm I thought that was a fucking stick of dynamite. I was like, I thought that was dynamite. I'm not gonna fucking lie to you. Hey, doing it for women is a good reason. Not gonna hate on you for doing it for women. I mean, hey, it's part of the reason I do it too. So, it's not my biggest reason. My biggest reason is like health and being strong, but you know, women help as well. Also, exercise is generally fun. Even if it's just weights and shit, it is something I enjoy doing because it produces happy, happy drug and brain. Just like coffee. However, because it requires effort, I need to be able to push myself to start doing it, which is the hard part. Why are you sitting there? I'm tutoring Vincent and Jay today. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. Understandable. Oh, hi, it's good to see you again. Take it easy. <laughs> Go die. Why am I here? We're just walking around. Clint. You want me to upgrade your tool? Cool. Fee, of course. Yep. Okay, bye. Damn it. Those weights are very... I don't know. Maybe I'll work out after stream today. I'll see how it goes. Usually after stream, it's late, and then I don't want to do anything, because... Excuses. Ten dollars a month. Yeah, no, I've got all that home equipment stuff because, you know, it's very useful. Like a lot of machines. Well, not a lot of machines. There's a couple of machines. Your only motivation is that you have to pay for it. Yeah. It's reasonable. 
I feel bad if I don't work out, honestly. I feel like, uh, feel like I'm, mm, what's the word? I feel like I should be doing it, like I'm missing something. It's hard to believe we're finally married. It took less than a fucking year, Abigail. Tomorrow is the dance, right? No, fuck it. You know what? I'm bored. I'm doing a single run of Genemo card endless mode. I don't know. Probably, in some way. I wonder if you can remarry somebody. Like, you can marry someone twice, you can divorce them, and then just fucking say, Hey, uh, I like you again. Alright, that was my one run of Genemo card. Thank you for watching. I think you can divorce her. That's actually a good question, can you? Stardew div. I turned on caps lock. Stardew divorce. So, if they choose the book on their animal pop up, give it. Wait, is this for a mod? Can you remarry after divorce? You can date and remarry anybody you choose. Wait, no, sorry, that's something else. Any item the player had in the access room will be collected. Your children remain after divorce. Imagine you divorce someone and your children just fucking... Well, there's a fee for divorce in real life, too. You gotta pay the fucking, like, legal fees, don't you? Woman. Like, isn't there a lot of law involved in that, depending on where you are? I don't know if, like, you know, Morocco, if I remember correctly, is where you are. If that place has the same laws, but, like, it is a semi-difficult legal hassle to get married and unmarry and all that. I think get animals from Marnie at some point. I keep forgetting to do that. I don't have anything to do, do I? God fucking damn. Coffee beans to put away, I guess. I wonder how much all this would sell for. How much does a coffee bean sell for? Oh, yeah, I haven't sold one yet. I'm gonna sell a single coffee bean so I can learn how much they're worth. Alright, and then I'm gonna go to sleep. Immediately. Even though it's the middle of the day. Actually, no, depending... No, go back in my house. Depending on... Depending on a factor, I may not. I haven't been collecting daffodils like I was supposed to, because I need flowers to keep Sandy happy throughout the... Isn't this one of her favorite gifts, too? I think it is. I think it's, like, the flowers. She likes the flowers, and that's it. Daffodil! She is still here, and that means... Cheating is a crime here. Yeah. Reasonable. Have rules due to my... Yeah, no. Isn't that, like... Wasn't that partially for religious reasons, originally? And, you know, probably still is, because of how the country and everything is. I wonder if he can fish in that water, down at the bottom, with the right pool. Not the right pool. Why does the water here look so fucking dumb? It's like they didn't want to animate it this time. Did I have something here? Yeah, that's what it was. I can remember it now. It was like right... I was like right here. Right? Strange doll. I got a strange doll. Yeah. I have no idea what the fuck to do with that. Oh, wait, it is. You poor burnt thing. You can find coconuts and cactus fruit outside. They're oh yummy. Did I like ignore my glacier with her so long that it went down again? I did. There's a winter flower in the middle of and almost towards summer. Ignorance can be a gift sometimes. Oh. It's a palm leaf fossil. 
fuck cares about a fossilized palm leaf? I'm not a paleontologist. I'm not gonna study it. Yep, turn sturdy. That's the stairs. Almost been an hour. What do you want? No, not at all. Give me the ice cream. My mom can't open ice cream on her own because it you didn't give me paper towel to do this with. I can use an entire pair of jeans. Sorry, I had a pair of jeans on hand that I just used to open ice cream with. Don't mind those. It's like the only messy spot in my room besides... Okay, I take that back. This side of my room is messy right now. Everywhere else is fine. Um, don't fucking crucify me. Yeah, my mom's missing all the fingers I have down. She only has these two fingers on her left hand. So this is like almost genuinely what her left hand look like, looks like. So when she tries to open something, she has difficulty because of like... If it's even slightly difficult to open, her hand makes it even harder. And there's paper on the ice cream thing, so that she's... That's what I was going to tell her about my day. If only I could. So there's paper under the lid on those ice cream things that she eats, so she can't open them properly because it makes it more difficult. And my day... I made 15. <laughs> and that was the end of it. Took me through that whole thing just to say 15. <laughs> my day... My day has been... It's been my day. There's nothing really- it's like most of my other days recently, there's nothing much has happened. Instructions on how to make a super healthy meal. You'll feel energized. Red plate? Did she teach me how to dye a plate red? What the fuck is this recipe gonna be? There it is. Red cabbage and radish. Plus 50 max energy! Damn! That's something you make a million of in the summer, and then take that with you when you go to the fucking mines. Holy shit, 50? 50 is a little high, if you fucking understand how the stat- like... Out of 372, 50, it makes a big fucking difference. No, not fucking up. I hate the curse. It's been fun. I haven't done much of anything today. Like, at all. There, were no, there was no leftover sushi, sadly, since me and my sister finished it yesterday, but, you know. Other than that, my day's been fine. All the same as usual. Damn, no crows. No crows? Uh, I can't talk to the fucking wizard. I'm gonna go talk to my cat. That's the best thing I can do with my time. Oh yeah, hold on. I gotta go message somebody. That is the 16th for me. Uh, Discord here, here. I'll feed you at least. Birthday for me. I had to wish somebody a happy birthday because their birthday is... They're in a different time zone. They're in like... I think they're just past your time zone. So... It's their six hours ahead, so it's their birthday already. It's It would be their birthday in your time zone as well because you're five hours ahead. So as soon as I start streaming, it's time. <laughs> so like, yeah, I had to do that real quick. And they were six hours ahead, if I remember correctly. It was three something, then it was nine for them, so. Yeah, six hours. Fucking flower dance takes fucking. I hate waiting for events in this game. Looks like it takes fucking ages.
<laughs> Get a fucking way. Is that a frame issue? I haven't had one of those in a while. Not a major one like that. It was very convenient that the whole frame skipping thing stopped happening. Damn. Stopped happening, like, right as I went to beat Janemo Cardigan. So this is the music for this. Last time I was here, there was literally no music because I had it turned off. What are you selling? A lot of daffodils and dandelions. So that's what? 5,000? Or 500? Sorry, wrong, wrong thing. 50 times 10, 500, yep. Oh, also a rare crow. My wife! I really hate dancing for front of everyone, it's so embarrassing. Mom makes me do it. Well, yes, do you? I like that. Dance with me! But, but I wanted to dance with. Just kidding, of course. Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Love that response. Great response. <laughs> All right, where's Lewis? That's literally all that matters here. Yep, let's start. Yeah, now we get music for this part, like we didn't last time. Right? Oh my god. Look, I'm so out of place. I'm so insanely out of place. Very nice music. Why am I so far ahead of everyone else, too? Why do I have the biggest fucking legs? Look at everybody else's fucking, like, minuscule noodle legs, and then look at my fucking wide-ass legs. Look at my fucking massive fucking, like, perkies of legs. Was that the entire dance? We just walk towards each other and, like, sway and everything. It's time to go home. Dude, I'm fucking wide compared to everybody else there. I got thicker thighs than my wife. Woman! Damn. Woman! You sleeping? Damn. Cat. Sleep. Sleep. Dance with her and go to sleep. Woman! Did we discuss yesterday? Is that what happens now? I always loved this place long before you moved in. Now I can explore the farm whenever I want. Yeah, hell yeah. Oh yeah, I checked out the fucking... I remember talking about it on stream. There's a Abigail character bot thing on character.ai. And I decided to check that out. And their entire start of their conversation is talking about how uh, there's someone new. I guess I can't explore that little farm that I used to explore. That was their starting message. So fucking, now I know why. That is a lot of fucking sap. I need to do something with sap. What can I make with sap? With just sap. Well, it's kind of probably trap, Bobby. So I guess it's this is this is fun. It's literally just Abigail. It's just her name. Damn, that's expensive. I need oak resin still. Almost nothing takes a lot of fucking resin for some reason, which sucks because I really want to spend my fucking resin. I have like way too much of it. Or sorry, sap, not resin. I'm thinking about a different game where it's called resin. Yeah, you make an account on beta.character.ai and then talk to Abigail, whole conversation. You can do that with like most of the characters in the game, I believe. They're generally accurate, just keep in mind that AI is a little too limited to be perfectly accurate. That's why I have beans. Okay. I was very confused as to why there were beans in my inventory. I think her name is A-B-I-G-A-I-L. Yeah. A B A B I G A I L. I should know how to spell my fucking wife's name, you know. I'm gonna go sell some shit, get it out of my inventory so I can actually pick shit up and do the shit I was about to do. Gotta donate some stuff to Gunther today. So I'm pretty sure I have like two things in this chest that can be donated. This and that. 
Oh yeah, wait, I can go make sure nothing in my inventory can't be taken out. Yeah, there we go. Then I have a lot of wood on me as well. Because I was cut trees, yeah. And a tiny bit of stone that can also be taken from my inventory. Anything else? Judge Cola for that. Okay, that's everything. Uh, the website? Uh, literally just character, period, AI. That is the website. That is what it's called. Character.ai. I think it doesn't matter if you search it with the beta in front of it or not, because it's supposed to be beta.character.ai, but because, you know, it's in beta. Five crows. Have you scared off any crows? Dumb bitch. Dumbass snowman. Can I just walk through the... Can I just walk through it if I try to walk into it long enough? No. You know, theoretically, that one thing where you... Because there, there's this thing in theoretical physics where if you, like, touch your hand to a table, there's a chance, a fucking minute, infinitely small chance that your hand phases through the table because all of your atoms misalign perfectly to phase through each other. Theoretically, and very commonly, that is possible in a video game. If you walk at a wall enough times, there's a chance you have a big enough, like, system error that you just phase through the wall. You just fucking go right through it. Although that requires a lot of issues on the game's part. And a really shit computer most of the time. And again, I know what beta.character.ai is because I used to have like 60 hours on it per fucking week. In school, too. Like, I was I was doing classes and I still had that much fucking time in. I void isn't still right, yeah. I think this is the second time I get to do that, the only time. Chances are one out of infinity. Essentially. Very essentially. But it is still theoretically possible. Due to how the laws of physics work is a thing that can happen. I mean, if you check the chances, hold on, I'm gonna go Google chances my hand phases through a table. Chances your hand goes through table, bam. So it is about 1 in 5.2 to the 61st chance. So 1, so what, what you're gonna look at, so imagine 5.2, put 60 zeros, at, or 60 zeros after it. One in that is your chance to have your hand face through a table. Because it requires every single atom to align perfectly using the laws of and using the law of entropy as well, because you know, entropy exists and it'll always try to be in the most ordered state. But there's a chance that due to entropy, there will be enough chaos in the system, very minute chance there will be enough chaos in the system, that your hand can just face through a table. Because everything moves towards chaos. Although at the same time, things try to stay, or they try to stay ordered, but they do still, you know. Stop telling flowers fucking speak to you, you're, in you're schizophrenic. What was I saying? Damn it, I can't move shit in her house. I was gonna pick up her fucking- I was gonna pick up her rug and take it. Why does her couch- why is her couch shaped like that? Why are there two massive aspirins? Nobody sits on that couch enough for there to be fucking seat divots like that. Isn't Sandy's birthday soon? Oh, it's Emily's birth birthday that's soon. It's in two days. I literally cannot give her a birthday gift, I don't think, because I already gave her two gifts. Fuck you, Pierre, I don't give a shit about you. I'm only assuming right there. Oop. I'm looking for a flounder to bring to my evening book club. Who the fuck brings a flounder to book club? Oh yeah, Gunther's. And I would give him all these things. Donate a bunch of shit to him, like his mask, his leaf. Go 
golden mask. That can go here. This. 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 And fuck it, you can have the strange doll. I don't want it. I got a skeleton and a bear statue. I stand as tall- I stand taller than a skeleton, actually. Well, even with the hat off. And I stand at, like, half the height of a fucking bear. Oh, I can just pick it up like that? Okay. I thought I was gonna have to smack it with a pickaxe, but no. Where's the bitch? I wanna go to the fucking desert. She's supposed to be here by now. Where the fuck is she? Where's the where's the alcoholic woman? Why isn't she there? I wanna go to the fucking I wanna go to the desert. I think I said beach a moment ago. Wrong blonde woman! I've decided I'm going to organize my clothes today. I have to throw throw out all of the last year's styles to make room for the new ones. I don't like her. I really don't like her. She's too basic. Basic white girl. Why are you going now? What the fuck? It's 12 p.m. You're usually there at like 10. That ain't the fucking bus stop. Come here. Plan on spending a lot of time with my telescope this summer. Okay. You. Nutrition is important, so make sure you eat well. Try to increase your vegetable intake. I don't fucking eat. Home cooked meals are best. Do you cook? Not really. Kind of. Can I sit on this? No. <laughs> oh. His bedroom is up. Oh, he lives in the fucking hospital. No, fuck it. I'm going. I can't lay in bed. Damn it. Can I sit on the stool? Why do I sit like that? This is not how you sit on a fucking stool. I'm not fucking sit on this trash can. Why is he just standing there? He just... Damn. The fuck is just looking. The saloon can get pretty lively at night. Sometimes I even, we even put a coin in the jukebox. I need to visit once a week or so to catch up on things anyways. So every Friday I'd assume. I just realized I'm under 80,000 again. I'm poor. Those bots are greater than chat GDP and Bard. I don't know what Bard is, but the bots on character.ai, they're they're just built for roleplay. They're not as built for information as chat GPT is. Chat GPT will give you accurate information, while uh, character AI will give you um, creative information, essentially. They're really good for conversation, mostly. But they're not good for information, for the most part. Well, they are also semi-good for that, depending on the bot you're talking to, because they do have bots made for that. Like, they have the 1.2 bots, like Stella and stuff. They're all, like, extra chained, extra trained, not chained, extra trained chatbots. Bard, okay, Bard is Google. Chat G, okay. Yeah, because ChatGPT is now owned by Microsoft, isn't it? Yeah, GPT-4 GPT is literally a built-in feature to, like, Bing now, I'm pretty sure. Which is fucking wild, but, you know. That's how it is. Three, damn, good job. These are starting to grow enough to stop me from walking into them. I can still get back here, right? Yeah. Yeah, I can still get back here perfectly, even if they all grew fully. Ten lines back. What the fuck are you talking about with it? Yeah, they can do a lot, but it's a matter of how factual the information is. Like, is everything she said completely accurate? Is any of it, like, at all? Actually, no, I guess with World War II, that is pretty good, pretty easy to get information. Not supposed to talk to strangers? Well, that sucks for you. I'm gonna do nothing. So 
so threatening. So insanely threatening. What about my fiber? I could have sworn I had a ton of fiber. Hmm. Oh yeah, my statues. Good additions to the house. <laughs> to block Abigail from standing next to the fucking TV. Uh, depending on the bot that you run into, you can get a really good bot, you can get a shit bot that does nothing. Some of them are trained really well. Yeah, drink water. I'm gonna drink coffee for now. Water comes later. Where am I fucking going? What's wrong with that? Not done. The woman isn't though. She's not at the fucking bus stop, I forgot. Bitch. I think Friday is Emily's birthday. Can you give somebody a gift on their birthday even if you've already given them two gifts in a week? Fuck. Finny, I just want to say that I appreciate all the hard work you do for us. I'm really proud of you. Damn. Okay. Uh, hey, Rat and Joey, what's up? Why are you hee hee and Let me going to sleep that early. It's not important. Oh, yeah, I can check birthdays on this. Yeah. Birthday is the 27th, so tomorrow. Michael Jackson enjoyed the stream. <laughs> going into town today, just so you know. Alright, you do that. You have your fun. Oh wait, I can move the bear! Hold on. <laughs> Watching my favorite show. <laughs> oh. I, I, can I get off this fucking chair? I think I just fucking softlocked myself. I, I get genuinely fucked up. How do I get off this chair? How do I get off the chair? <laughs> There we go. Okay, I thought I was fucking trapped. It wouldn't let me off the fucking chair. That is not how light works, game. That is not how light fucking works. Oh wait, that's what I can put in there. That's what I can get there. No! No! Fuck that shit. Putting these back where they belong. In the corner. Guess he was gonna sleep on my couch for a few days. It, didn't he move in nearby to you? Why the fuck? He just, he's just confiscating your couch? He, he, just, he just moved in like, yeah, this is my couch now. Fucking nose itches like hell. I fucking hate it. You came into your life because your mom said so. And then he just fucking said, yep, my couch now. At least he eats the leftovers. That does just sound like a cockroach moved into your house. He's a cockroach. A cockroach moved into your fucking house. <laughs> Any of these close to growing yet? Ooh, some of them are really close. Very nice. Congrats on the rat. <laughs> you got a new rat, yeah. Oh, that person we raided that one time. Siren AU was left. Mr. Rat and Joey. Egg, copper, copper, cave, wild, just about. <gasps> Ooh, maybe. What if he's a cockroach and he. <gasps> oh my god, the conspiracy theories go wild. 
You've got a, you've got a human. Oh my god, it's like the fucking guy. It's like the alien from that fucking from Men in Black. It's like the fucking guy from that where he peels off the human suit to reveal something that looks like a fucking cockroach. Does he seem inhuman to you? Tear off the suit. Yeah, go, go rip his skin off. Peel off his skin, peel off his skin, peel off his skin. Peel off everyone around you's skin to make sure they're not cockroaches and there's no bugs under their skin. How the fuck the word cockroaches? It's, uh, it's not start for me, that's... Get angry in it. It's not start on my end, so that means that that's because you have, um... Shit, what, what's the word? Big barn. Deluxe coop. Spent all that fucking money. <laughs> How angry is he? The angry that you just that you found <laughs> that you broke his cover. Are you about to be domestically abused? How bad is it? Mm. Oh. I found that drunk guy, Mister. Yeah. I found the drivers from the motorcycle video. So what's that motherfucker got knocked off a bike? Knocked off a fucking motorcycle. Hit the ground. He took away your rat. Mm. That's mean. It's very mean. Maybe. Okay, so I guess you just shouldn't try to peel off his skin next time. I don't think he liked it very much. He was a little upset. Just, just a little. You got it back. Good job. No, I wouldn't. Well, unless you were a cactus farmer. I can farm anything. Have a deal. I get two stars. What is her room? What? Uh, Snapchat notification. Snapchat notifications always break my watch slightly. What the fuck is behind you? Can I fucking kill this guy? It's for members only, kid. Now scram. What if I give you a field snack? Damn it. Members of what? I break in. I chopped down palm trees? Hold on. Oh. I actually can. I didn't think I'd actually be able to. But I could just fucking walk around and chop down, chop down the fucking trees. I mean, it gets me experience, so I'll take it. You have a weird, like, memory of my physics class, and I keep for some reason remembering weird shit about how strong different forces are relative to each other. Like how gravity is a very weak force and requires an insane amount of its variables to actually be strong at all. But then, magnet forces and the strong force that holds atoms together are fucking insane. Strong force. The strongest force that we know of in the universe. Or is it weak force? No, it's... Yeah, it's strong force. Holds atoms together. It only takes two pounds to cave someone's nose into that brain. Well, I mean... I think I've heard that before, but I think I heard higher numbers. Um... 
force to push someone's nose into their brain. Uh, oh, pushing the nose into the brain is not possible. Or is that one of two answers? Well, there's no bone in there, so pushing your nose into your brain, you're pushing cartilage. Yeah, no, that happens commonly because it's a myth. That's the whole thing. You have a plate behind your nose to protect your brain from that kind of thing. Yeah, no, you can't push a nose through a skull. It's too weak because of the, uh, oh, yeah, okay. It's too weak because it's made of cartilage and not bone. So there, it's, there's like nothing to push into the skull. Also, you know, even if you, if you could, humans would have died so many years ago. So many insane years ago. If all it took was bot on the nose, we'd have fucking... That alone was a, is around two pounds of force. I could smack myself on the nose really fucking hard. Your nose wouldn't break, or, you know, you couldn't break your nose sideways if hitting it with two pounds of force could kill you. It just smacks into your fucking skull really hard. Why am I here? I feel like I'm here for something, but I can't remember what. Just knocking the controller around. I swore I was here for something. My brain told me to come here. You probably should, because it's already like past midnight for you. Another Stardew streamer is live? Yeah. There's quite a lot of people that stream this video game. It's kind of popular. You know, there's kind of like 4.2 thousand people watching the stream. Where do I sit in the ranking of high to low viewers? Rather low because of how many people have barely more viewers than I do. What is my... There I am. Found myself. I'm, I'm low down in my stream. It's not the most lively looking. But it's there. It's up there. I don't have fucking hundreds of viewers like the people at the top. Well, they only have 100 or close to 200. That motherfucker has 199, like, exactly. I'm like just barely off 200. Also, I could give myself an extra viewer because I can count as a viewer in my own stream. So if I just opened up my, literally all I'd have to do is hit show player on my Twitch, on my stream manager. I have a stream manager, that's how Twitch has, that's how Twitch lets you monitor everything. If I hit show preview for my own stream, so I'm seeing what my stream has on it, I'll count as a viewer. Even though I'm looking at it from the fucking, from, I'm the streamer, and I'm looking at the moderation of my stream, and it counts me as a viewer. Yeah, some of them do have viewers just because I wouldn't. That is, that is true. I don't have that advantage. The fuck are you doing to my- the fuck are you doing to my plant? Cat was fucking wiggling my coffee plant around. Oh, I need my pan. There's or there's stuff in the water right there. Iron. Can I do that anywhere? Does it have to be next to a spot? Does it have to be next to a spot? You know, if they only had high viewership because they were women, then you know. That would be unfair, but no, they do also put in the effort to actually have a good viewership. Because you have to stream often and everything. You can't just get hundreds of viewers because... <gasps> no, you have to 
actually put in the effort to get people to come to your stream by streaming often. Like how I only have viewers because I stream at the exact same time every single fucking day. If I didn't, I'd have a lot less viewers. Because I'd have missed a day where one of you was online scrolling through streams, then I, you know, one of you probably wouldn't be here. Frequency helps grow views. Frequency. Consistency isn't as important. Frequency is important. If I streamed for 24 hours a fucking day, I'd end up with more viewers popping into the stream and then fucking off. But I probably... I may or may not end up with actual viewers after that. Because you have to get lucky with when the people who would view your content end up searching for their content. Otherwise, I want to check my YouTube analytics. I did earlier, actually. There's no point. I realized I'm up to 103 views, views again in total. Stop shaking the fucking coffee plant! Fuck off! Move! My ass cat. A bunch of forgeable items. Oh, that goes in here. Where did I get bait from? Why do I not remember getting bait? I tend to remember that kind of stuff. Oh yeah, I got another diamond to chuck in there. Uh, fuck it, I'm just gonna eat this field snack just to get rid of it. I don't want it anymore. And with this. That was not... That is not what Jojo Cola looks like. Sorry to say. These are oak trees. Top right one is an apple tree, but the, the, these trees are oak trees. Can I? I can't tap those. Good to know. I don't know if I'm supposed to tap them, but I can't. It's, it's, an, it's something I'm allowed to do. Is it sleep time? Where the fuck? Oh, my wife is going to town, yeah. She just teleports away, so that means I have one, two, three, four, five. I have five rare crows. Do I have any more than that? I think I have five. I mean, I'm missing three, so. I have a witch, a snowman, that weird-ass face, a woman, and uh, some dude, I'm pretty sure. She said she went into town, but where the fuck did she go? Did she go home? Did she go to her room for no reason? She was bored? No? How the fuck is there a hamster here? Her hamster's at my house. Did she get a new hamster for my house? It's a fine looking day. Days like this, I like to help Evelyn with the public gardens. She's strong for her age, but I think she appreciates all the help she can get. Only yeah, as you get older, you get weaker. Unless you really keep up with training. Even then, your body slowly deteriorates as you get older. Where's my wife? You dig in the dirt, you can find some interesting things. One time I found a really old piece of pottery. I brought it to Gunther and he said it was over a thousand years old. Where's the woman? The weather doesn't really matter to me. I typically stay in my shop year-round. Depressing, huh? I, no, I... Well, I mean... No, not really, honestly. I do just about the same thing, but like... Farming. And the weather also doesn't... No, the weather does matter to me, because there's fish that I can only catch in certain seasons. And because when it rains, I don't have to fucking water my crops. Those are the only two ways I give a shit about the weather. The only two. Hold on, my computer fan yelling at me. I'm opening Task Manager to figure out why. Why my computer yelling. No, I don't want my... F I don't want that. Fuck you. Task Manager. How the fuck is Streamlabs taking up more processing power than a fucking video game? By like three times the amount. Damn. Okay. Yeah, I might switch over to OBS just for a lower amount of RAM usage. And, well, not even just RAM usage. That would still be high, but like for a lower amount of GPU usage. Yeah, because OBS takes less processing power. Streamlabs just... It was slightly more user-friendly in the beginning. 
I got used to how it worked a little quicker. Either one works. It's just that Streamlabs is better for beginners and better if you want to put on like an overlay with all the special stuff, which I don't do. But you know, what was I doing? It is sleep time, yeah. Did I water my plants? I don't remember. Where's my wife? Am I gonna find her playing the flute thing again? Yep. That's exactly what I'm gonna find her. Yoink. Bait. I used OBS initially, but then I switched over like halfway through because I was having small issues that I didn't like dealing with. I can always switch back though. Not like I need the GPU power for what I play at the moment. I'll probably deal with all that like maybe right after stream today because it really doesn't take long to fidget with all of that in a day. That's Emily's birthday, yeah. So my relationship with her looking like it's almost maxed out for what it can be given the fact that she's a woman and single. I'm not gonna fucking date every woman. I'm not cheating on my wife. Have you made any headway with the four spirits? Quite a bit of it, yet. Yeah. Yep, can't give him any gifts. Uh, I basically have the fucking thing done, surprisingly. I didn't think I'd get this far at any point. Do I actually need animal products? Hold on. No, I don't need animal products. Shit, well, actually, sorry, fuck, I said that, and then I'm like, oh, fuck, I guess I do. Which ones do I need? I only need a certain amount of them, right? I need five out of six, so if I can get... Adios, oh, you're leaving? Okay. Yeah, because you should sleep. Yeah, I was about to say, I literally just said, but, you know, because you, it's really late for you, see ya. Good night, man. Don't, uh, don't die tomorrow. I don't fucking know. Get better. Stop being sick. There's a fucking data cable hanging out of my ceiling right there. Not the traditional one, like a TV one. Yep, see you on the next stream. So I need milk. Milk, egg, milk. Milk, egg, egg, milk, and cloth. So milk, milk, egg, egg, cloth. Or I think there's also one other option for that. That being egg again but you know these two eggs are easy this egg or the milks are both doable and then oh i'll figure out if i can get them might take me a while but eventually my man it's her birthday i need to be let in rats rats I'm gonna start saying that when shit goes wrong, just to like, be slightly on brand with it. Like, I fucking die and I'm just go, all oh, rats. <laughs> Woman, it is your birthday. Come forth. Do you ever think about the texture of fabric, Vinny? Each, fa each texture has a different person or distinct personality. Feel my dress, see? Okay, here's a ruby for your birthday. And relationship with her is maxed out. I just gotta keep it that way now. I feel like she's the type of girl to go, my dress has pockets, and then shove her hands really deep into her fucking pockets because, you know. Check Discord. Why do I not get fucking Discord notifications? Oh, there's literally just. There it is. It took forever to go through. What is this? An aspiring novelist who lives in a beach cabin and spends a good amount of time at the beach or at the bar. Yeah, this guy's got coke. <laughs> what? 
<laughs> just be ready for him to hold you captive for the next three hours while he excitedly explains his next big idea, which will, like, totally be bigger than a song of fire and an ice and fire. What the fuck am I looking at? I... I, I, don't, I don't know what I'm supposed to be. Bitch. There's not enough time left in the season for me to have parsnips. Oh. Not surprising. Let me go search something real quick. Because now that I'm at 8 hearts with her, um... I'm at least starting. Heart events in this game, right? Yeah. Every Stardew Valley resident ranked by how comfortable I would be asking them for drugs. <laughs> yeah, this guy's got coke. Okay. Now I get it. The mayor's... What the fuck is the mayor's manor again? Oh, just the mayor's house. Okay. And... Abigail. I don't know why, but the name Abigail just will not stick in my head easily. Check heart events, even though I'm already married to her. What are the backwoods? Probably there. Alright. I think this is the quickest way there. That's a lot of daffodils. Taking those before I do anything else. Before the stream, I'm an hour and 40 into the stream, so I still got hour 20. Hour 20 left. Got it. I accidentally nudged my laptop. Oh my, what are you saying oh my to? Here it is. The fuck? Yeah, because that's the reaction I would have to that. Gasp. Damn, that thing went down quick, and now I'm fucking dying. Benny? Yes? Am I okay? I don't think I am. Can my eyes open, please? Oh. Looks like you just scraped up a little. You had me worried. Hell yeah. The hug. Hell, the fuck is that? I I've never taken a life before. It was exciting. Okay. I need to go... I need to go see which of these options I pick. Okay, so... They all do the exact same thing. Uh... I, I don't know. Aren't they just trying to survive like us? Uh, did what I had to. I guess the world's a pretty tough place. It was either you or him, right? I guess. So I'm not going to guilt trip her. It's a harsh world. Or it's sad, but there's no other option. Honestly, yeah. I did what I had to. I guess the world's a pretty tough place either. You were him, right? Very true. Look, you've got to be more careful now, and I don't want to lose you. Honestly, I find it bullshit how my character reacted to that situation. I fucking made it to level 120 in the mines. I should not be fucked up by this dude who got killed in three hits by a woman who's barely fought and who's never taken a life. I've taken hundreds of lives from monsters, and this woman who has never killed a single a single liver a single living being in her life fucking killed him in three hits. Put him to rest nearby. Okay. Now there's a monster grave. Uh, 
Abigail took a life to save mine. I'll never forget that. Does it say that every time? Hell yeah. That was literally the only reason I came up here. Ooh, leak. Okay, bye. So the guy went to the went to the store a few minutes ago, and he came back with a box of cupcakes, honey buns, cosmic brownies, and said, "Let's watch a movie." Okay, movie night time. Dude's treating you to snacks. To he's, he's bribing you to watch a movie. The only way he could entice you. Why are these look? Why do these look like they're dying? I don't like some. I don't like the way some of those look. It scares me a tad bit. Any fucking thing else to do in my day. You do that. Now, yeah, see you hopefully on the next stream. I always forget to put some snacks in my pocket. Rumble. Good thing I brought my sword today. What the fuck do those two things have to do with each other? Or is that because she saved my life? Probably because she saved my life. She did have the sword, probably. I don't know. I didn't see it. But yeah, you, you go do that. What am I doing? I'm gonna go talk to my wife. Actually, I'm gonna go here first. I have this crazy new idea that I, I wanna... It's called clothing therapy. Please come to the mayor's house today to see what it's up. Oh, more letters? How are you doing? I hope you enjoy the gift I sent you. Well, goodbye. She... <gasps> oh my fucking god, thank you, Emily. I could never have asked for a single fucking other thing, honestly. I got up early and watered some? Which ones aren't watered? They all look watered. Did she just do all of it for me? She did. Damn. Bless that woman. Holy shit. Damn. Two gifts today. Oh, talk to my fucking cat. Scarecrow. Rare crow, I should say. Yeah, I've got Jack Skellington. Wicked Witch of the West. Snowman. That and woman. Literally just the female version of the one that I make, but yeah. Who the mayor's house I go? Fucking! I wake up before you, Mayor. Let me in. Eight seconds left. Pretty sure my reaction speed, reaction time for my reaction speed is like two fifty milliseconds. I think I react quicker than that, but you know, when I actually do the thing that I'm reacting to, yeah. Welcome to clothing therapy. My wife is here, hell yeah. You're probably wondering, what is clothing therapy? I'll try to explain. So, many of us are struggling with personal issues, things holding us back from living where we want to. It's important to me that everyone has a free and happy life, so I came up with a new kind of therapy to help people achieve that. It's based on the amazing power of self-expression. Self-expression is a wonderful healing tool, did you know that? Behind this curtain, you'll find racks and racks of clothes. There's endless options to choose from. Your job is simple. Find the outfit that truly speaks to you and put it on. Feel confident in yourself and your choice. You all have a unique style to share with the world. Shane, you're up first. Yes, yeah, Shane. There's literally nothing back there. Where the fuck is he going? That shit transport him to another dimension? Oh, hey, here I am. I'm just in time. Just observe and keep an eye out, or keep an open mind. Okay. <laughs> cool. Cool, she says. It's a new side of you that we've never known about. That's great. Uh, go outside with confidence and show the world. Dot, dot, dot. 
Sure. Just, yeah, okay. Sure. Fuck it, fuck it. may as well. Okay, everyone gets a turn. Yeah, Robin. Oh no, says Clint. He he. Oh god. Oh, just a dress. That's nice looking. Oh. Let's see what Demetrius thinks. Ooh. Why not? Says the mayor. What's he gonna turn into? I'm horrified. <laughs> not bad. Ooh, what's it? I love it. That's honestly great. Look at he is looking quite fucking. Look at his drip. Look at the purple. That motherfucker's pimping. Yeah, go up, Abigail. Go up, my wife. My wife's true, true nature. Oh fuck! Oh my fucking god, that's beautiful. Look at her in a suit of fucking armor. Yeah, it's sweaty in here. Hell yeah. That's amazing. I wonder if she's gonna walk around like that for the rest of the fucking day. That'd be amazing. Clint, you're up. Why do I go last? He's fucking shaking in his boots. Okay, Emily, I'll do it. Yeah, look at how fucking wide Clint is. Normal Clint. Cute. Aw, uh, cute. Ha, sorry. And then he just leaves. What's up? Well, that went very well. I just this exercise. I was going to break into the shells, but oh, thank God, I don't have to go. She's, she's not making me have to go. Why? She's tearing me down. Um, couldn't do it. I don't want to break out of my shell. Uh, I, I guess I'm interrupting something here, and I. Oh, oh, the sadness. I understand. I'll leave now. Congrats, Finny. I feel so bad. What the fuck is that? The town's lost and found box. You can collect incomplete deliveries from past special orders here. Okay. Looking for a big water bugs. The juicier, the better. At least that's what the crab seemed like. A hundred pieces. I can't do that in a single day. Calling all amateur paleo a hundred pieces of don't go go die, damn. Okay. I ain't no paleontologist. Although I have accidentally uncovered a lot of shit, so I'm pretty close. I'm pretty close. I really hope she's still in armor. That'd be hilarious. That'd be great if she was still in the armor. Damn it! That's a filled. Oh! I just forgot to put some snacks in my pocket. Rumble. Wow. Actually, is it supposed to be a hug if I'm like level with her? I think. Yeah. I don't know. It could be a forehead kiss like when we got married, but. Am I supposed to be filling that every day? I. I. Have I been making my cat die of thirst slowly? No, I didn't want the rocks. Man, what does it take to make a keg again? Oak resin. There you go. I didn't actually go look at the status of the oak resin that I have going, but I think it takes a couple days. So yeah, it's not done. I don't even know if I'm gonna get oak resin off of that. For all I know, I won't. Chicken. I have nothing else to do in the day, do I? I think it's time to just call it a day. In game, obviously. I could end stream, but I'm not gonna. No. Yeah. Didn't want a repeat of last time. Sounds better. that down for a moment. Oh, where I fucking want you. 
Thank you. Turning it does nothing. <laughs> Look at that. That's beautiful. That's great. That's amazing. That's absolutely amazing. I just, it's like modern art. Beautiful. So dumb. I'm just gonna leave the boat in the middle of the floor. No, the boat. The boat can sit next to the table. My house is so well decorated. You you got all of my dumb shit across the room. And then you just come over here, and then there's all this. You have an actually nice looking room. <laughs> Woman. Hmm. I think we got plenty of space for outdoor slime ranching. Slime ranching. Actually, am I, have my trees grown yet? Another chicken statue? Oh, I was about to try to put it in my house now. It's a different kind of chicken statue. Still none of these have grown. Damn, upset it. I didn't talk to the woman. Oh, and I can give, oh, I'm not going to give the woman any more gifts. If I give the woman more gifts, then it's going to do nothing because I already maxed up my relationship with her for before dating. I'm not dating anyone else. I'm married. Which sucks. Actually, it doesn't suck. I'm gonna let Clint do his thing. Then again, Clint's too nervous to do anything that he wants to do with her. I wonder if there's actually a way to get him, her and Clint together somehow. Like, there's some magic. Anything I want here. Fuck out of my face, dog here. Fuck off. That's kind of tempting. I do kind of want a... See, Jim. Was that? That looked like it was a kraken or something on it. Like it was a big ass squid. That'd be fucking. That would be so fitting. I got the sailor's cap from the ice fishing thing, so it would be. It would work. It would work fine. Sometimes observe them in secret, hoping to find things. Okay. Not done yet. I'm not done with him yet. Probably one more on him. Wait, doesn't the month end on the twenty eighth? Like after the 28th, does that mean tomorrow is going to be summer? Does that mean anything for me? I don't think that means anything for me. In terms of like the bundle and everything, I don't think- No, summer does actually mean a lot for me. I gotta do farming and everything for that season. I'm gonna go broke buying seeds again. Just like I did this season. I have not had music this entire time, and it's starting to slowly drive me mad as I just sit here and listen to the sounds that the game has, which is- they just aren't enough for me. I forgot fucking Apple Music hates me and won't fucking work for some reason. There we fucking go. Finally actually decided to start running. Alright, there we go. That song does not sound right when it's on this setup. There we go. Alright, I'm set. Play game now. I'm gonna read trash cans for a moment. Trash. Hmm, I found trash on the garbage. Who'd have guessed? Why are you home? house was left in our care by my parents they've been traveling the world for the last two years we have no idea when they'll be back i enjoy living here though it's a beautiful area and town is nice i can't give you more oh it's sunday i can't give you more gifts why would i that was a waste of a ruby i'm not dating you it's not happening and jerry told me to date everybody in the town at once i didn't fuck it happen it ain't no what's the word Blanch me I don't fucking know. Something. It's not happening. Whatever it is. Click. What am I doing? Maybe I can't help Clint get her. Let me go search some. Clint Stardew. Let's see. Let's see. He owns and runs the local blacksmith. Oh, uh. Let's see. Birthday's right after the Star Feast. Literally right after it. He has a lot of similar favorites to Emily. I can see why he likes her. Why is he only neutral with Iridium Ore? Like, what? Damn. Okay.
Okay, good to know. The recipe. Oh, that's not good. Mm. Oh, that's fucking... I fucked something up. <laughs> good to know. So... I had it. So the thing that I did literally earlier today, the clothing therapy thing, if I never triggered that, if I left Emily on seven hearts, if I never got her above seven hearts, Flint would have tried to ask her out on a date eventually when he hit, when I hit six hearts with him. That means that now he can't because I triggered that event. That's, that's very inconvenient for Clint. That was very Clint. That's. I feel bad. I fucked him up. I. I, I cock blocked Clint. I feel really bad about it. Uh, oh man. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go look at what I. I'm gonna go move on from that and look at what I need to get in the summer. I think the sunflower is in the summer. I'm pretty sure the poppy is too. And same with that, if I'm over it. Uh, pomegranate is, yeah. Okay. Almost ev everything I have left is really in the summer. Every new farming life is helping as you is turning out as you had hoped. I mean, enough so? Willie! If you purchase a high quality fishing rod to be able to catch bait and tackle to the line. Bait causes fish to bite faster, tackle can make your job a lot easier when reeling fishing. All kinds of tackle with different perks. They're usually a little flimsy, so don't be surprised if your tackle breaks after a while. I don't think you can go into his bedroom because he's like, he barely has one. I've already unlocked everything from him, right? Seems so. Oh, he has the little boat thing. To that is not, that bird is not in an actual position it can be in. No, fish the bird. Can I actually fish where that bird is sitting? Is that because of the position I'm in? Is it only able to go between a certain up? It's only it only it snaps to a vertical position on the tile grid in the game. That's interesting. I, mean, I guess it makes sense because then you can't fish on two different kinds of spots at once, and it's not as specific on where you have to fish and all that. Hello, hello. Um, the weather's interesting today. I'm just thinking. Sorry, don't be sorry. That's adorable. Hi. Do you have fun? With yeah. That's good, isn't it? Why the fuck did she ask me that? Of such basic conversation skills. My sister's so weird. Sometimes I wonder if we're actually related. Honestly, you're the weird one, but you know. Oh, hello. Friends with Gus, he's a pretty good guy. He even gives me free beer on my birthday. Hell yeah. He supports your alcoholic tendencies. What a friend. What a good friend. Letting her be an alcoholic. Such an amazing guy. And again, he makes money off it, technically, because it gets her in. Are all of these water- hold on. They were all watered. Damn, my wife really did all of that for me. The sound of the nights- and the sound of the night are louder out here. I'll never stop enjoying that. Sleep. Yep, sleep for the night. Bye-bye. Night-night. Go night-night. I only have like two or three more in-game days left. The spreading weeds have caused damage to your farm. I get sunburned very easily, so I need to be careful this time of year. I hope you like me pale. I absolutely love it. No, my fucking my beans. 
My beans died! No! So horrible! So awful! Oh my god! So horrible for me! I, I just realized, I, my farming space is like completely taken up by those trees. I'm not gonna be able to grow nearly as- Yeah, I am. I just have to grow it in different places. Very weird places, but you know, places. These are staying. Those are staying where they are. Actually, what I'm gonna do real quick, just because I'm getting- I'm slightly upset by the way that, that this is like laid out, is I'm gonna grow more coffee. Beautiful. I'm gonna chop this down. I can't put anything within two sp I can't put anything in the first space around any of these. I gotta be mindful of that, because if I do, they'll fucking hate me. The plants will hate me, yeah, that's what happened. I don't know if there's actually anything- Have I missed all of, like, the wizard's heart events or some shit? Wizard, Stardew. Wizard, scroll down. Have I missed- he only has one heart event, and it's you getting access to his basement. It's literally nothing else. He can give you four different gifts. At a random chance. So, an Iridium bar. After completing... The community center bundles. Trigger a cutscene at the railroad. A request that you find a dark talisman. Speak to Krobus in the sewers. Oh, okay. There's a lot of stuff left in this game. A lot more than I thought there was, and it's fucking insane. This game has way too much in it. <laughs> it's fucking completely wild. One, two, three. I did that wrong. Nope. Oh. Looks like I'm doing it this way, then. One, two. What seeds do I gotta buy this time of year? Because I know I need a lot of them. I need sweet pea and stuff. I need a lot of stuff. And what's the quest for today? Whose birthday that I care about is in this month? I guess Willy's. Earth crystal. I'm gonna put it on a tombstone and I'm just not gonna give him one. I'm sorry, man. Simply not happening. My bad. Gus is coming in here for today. I hate that they enter, like... Almost five minutes in game before the fucking place opens. It annoys me so greatly. All right, so I know I need melon. I don't think I need the majority of this though. I think the majority of this can be completely ignored. Still gonna grow it. I'm saying it could be ignored. All right, so I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Well, I have 12 things that I need to grow, so that's 120 slots off the bat, because I'm getting 10 of each at least. But I'm going to be getting more of the things that I need to complete bundles for, and to complete the bundle with. So that means that it's more... I started... I talked on beat with my song for a moment. Tomato, pepper, blueberry, melon. I don't have the inventory space for this. Um... Here we go. So that's 20 of those. I need 20 of these. I need... What's blueberries? I know it was peppers. That was 20. Yeah. Alright. Oh, I need a poppy as well. I only need one, but I'm still gonna grow 10. That's 11.
So. Ooh, there's corn! Need one more. I think I actually want 20 of that because of some of its uses. Alright, that's everything. Alright, I'm gonna go have fun planting those. It's gonna take me fucking forever, but let's fucking go. I got all day. My wife! My beautiful wife! I can't speak to her while she's fucking walking. Damn. Leaf colors have changed. So this is 10. It's gonna be this for a little while, so don't expect much commentary, because I'm running low on that right now. No, I'm not. I'm absolutely not running low on that. Because I've been watching so much of some other YouTubers recently, they just talk about the most random shit, or what they do is they talk about the game in an interesting way, but it's fucking impossible to do that. Literally do fucking chores, what am I supposed to say? Am I supposed to complain? Like, what the fuck do I do? That's like all I can do here, complain. Excuse me. So wait, this is one, two, three, four, five, six. That's sixty. That accounts for three of my twenty ones. I can just hold X for this. I didn't know I could just hold it. But I had to like press it again and again. Apparently, you can just hold it down. Oh yeah, I skipped blueberries, because I wasn't sure if they were necessary. I couldn't remember which, uh, summer thing it was. Yeah, it was blueberries. It means I gotta go back and get blueberries at some point. I'm also gonna be moving my scarecrows slightly. Because where they are right now, it makes it harder to move around. Oh, you walk faster on pads or something, isn't that a thing? Spru oh, it literally just spruces up your floors, so that is it. It doesn't do anything more than that. I have two ways to grow this, or to water this. I can do this. Actually, wait, no, this this is actually the best possible strategy. I'm gonna walk straight down the center and just do this. Wait, no, I did that wrong, hold on. So I do it that, and then I do this. And then for the last one, well, it's six down, but you, you know, it's still probably the most efficient way I can do it. All things considered. I may have to move this in order to have the space to grow everything what I'm attempting to grow here. So weirdly close to being on beat with the song I was listening to right there. So weirdly close. Six, seven, eight. That actually works perfectly in a certain way. It's just, it's gonna look bad with how everything mingles when it's like this. No, that's what I'll do. I'm not gonna put it directly next to the water because then, you know, I can lose stuff to the fucking ocean, but I'll do that at the very most. Alright, I can do five up. Actually, I could do ten all the way across if I move some stuff. Oh, my inventory's full. Because of all the seeds and everything. I haven't used this once. Why can't I put it here? There's nothing there. That I can see, actually. Hold on. No, there's just nothing there, and I just can't put it there. Maybe it's too close to the worm bin vertically, so it causes issues. Give me the fucking bear. There we go. I feel like my wife probably loves this fucking bear. Because of who she is. Just gives me that vibe. There's no reason to go this way around. I don't know why I do. Okay. Oh my god, because of how much I've expanded the size of my farm, I can actually 
put these guys to good use. I can't pick up more than one thing at a time, I forgot. You can come over here and protect it horizontally like that. You can sit next to this. Okay. One, two. Oh, hold on, let me go plant my melons real quick. Not the melons, the red cabbage. Uh, the red cabbage will go up here. I'm gonna plant the blueberries on this this part. As soon as I have them, that is. How many things do I have left to put? So I need one, two, three, four, five, six, six more rows. I can do four this way. Actually, I can do six. I can do five. Okay. There's quite a lot of planting and I just realized I'm not to water when I'm done with all that, so it's gonna be my energy is gonna be non existent at the end of the day. Do I get the diamond back for doing this? I do. That means that I can easily move it. I'm gonna put it right next to the lightning rod. No, I'm not I'm actually gonna move it even further. I'm gonna move the lightning rod too, I'm gonna move them both. Over here. You're gonna go probably right about there by the end of this. Okay. Just need that out of the way for now. I'm gonna go put some of the stuff that I don't need to carry on me away so that I have more inventory space. I know I'm carrying a few things. Wooden coal, or wooden stone, I should say. Because, you know, coal has literally nothing to do with my inventory right now. Sticks. Okay. I'm gonna... S I'm gonna plant some shit. And I have such a beautiful farm layout. Don't you agree? Motherfucker, I can't put... That's gonna fucking piss me off. That's gonna piss me off so bad. I'm not even, like, super OCD or anything. That Just look at it. Look how fucking disgusting that looks. Isn't that cabbage? Isn't that the fucking cabbage that I was supposed to plant? It is. Looks like where these are going... This is already all watered, it looks like. Yeah. I need water if I'm gonna water the rest of it. So it's in rows of 10, that means... May not technically be the most efficient- oh my fucking god. You know what? No. The corn is just all gonna be offset like that. I don't fucking care that it's getting late. I can farm into the fucking night. Easily. Actually, no. I do need to go buy something, though, if I'm gonna continue this. Because I gotta go get my fucking blueberries. I gotta go get another ten. Now, once I have those, I'm set. I'm, I just farm for the rest of the fucking night. And I'm definitely upgrading my fucking hoe over, this, over the fucking summer. God, it's gonna be fucking annoying to do this in the fall. So I gotta do the, like, the exact same fucking thing. Motherfucker! Looks like some of my blueberries are going to fucking daylight! I shoot myself. <sighs> yeah. Is that wasting my time walking there? I have anything to eat on me? 
nothing that gives energy. It's all my corn accounted for. Still the same watering process, essentially. Just one offset. I need to eat something or I'm gonna fucking die. Because I... Okay, give me a moment to eat something and I can show you why. I can show you the actual reason why. Which of these gives a low-esque amount of energy. And no bonus to anything salad. Because if you look down here, I have a bunch of trees growing, so I can't plant anything down here. Which means I had to somehow fit all of it up here. And in order to do that, I had to do this, and you can't hoe onto grass. So, you know. I'm fucked. Yeah, I started that tree farm a little too late into the season I started it in. I think that's everything watered, right? It should all be watered, though I do still need to put these around. Sorry, you're not going there. Alright, sorry to say. But like you gotta you gotta take a step back, buddy. What are you honestly? Everything's watered. My wife should Hopefully complain that the farm is fucking massive. <laughs> please tell me you did some of the watering today for the fucking god, please. Damn it, you just fed the fucking hamster. Damn it. Means I gotta go do all this shit again. No. <laughs> I don't wanna do this. I don't wanna do it. I don't wanna do it. So much work. Uh, I just realized one of the motherfucking crows ate my fuck some of my fucking crow, some piece of shit crow ate some of my fucking coffee. Start with this section. I mean, I really don't care what configuration my farm is in as long as it works, so I'm not gonna complain too much. It's just fucking stupid that I had to do it this way. Fuck, damn, it's frame skip. It's happening worse while farming than it does while playing a fucking Genemo cart. That's what. Fuck you. Fuck you, snowman. I need water. I'm watering them this way. It took till 9 fucking a.m. to do that, and it took half my energy. And I'm not even done planting everything yet. 
I'm, I'm not done planting everything. I still have more to plant. I still have more left. Pierre, blueberries, div. Notice how much money I spent nearly 16,000 on fucking. I spent all, around 16k, give or take a few thousand, on seeds. And now I have to work to keep them all watered at all times. And I ain't no bitch that's gonna be using sprinklers. Even though I could easily get enough sprinklers to water every single bit of this, because I'd only have to take out a few plants to sprinkle, like, just about everything. I cannot hoe that. Which means... Another offset. Everything's watered. Finally done. Finally done. How's that mahogany coming back here? Growing. That's what matters. Again, do I need to water my- I do need to give my cat water. I never fucking knew that. How did I not fucking know that? Taking a break? I guess being a farmer is easier than I thought. No, I'm I'm done. What the fuck you mean taking a break? I I watered everything. Actually, no. I guess it is a break because there still is more I could be doing. But you know, like cutting down that tree. No, I actually can't cut down that tree. You know why? Because due to these tiny bush things, I. I'm not physically capable of getting to that tree in the center. So every single tree needs to grow before I have the ability to cut down one that grows in the middle. Okay. That means I have two unusable sections of my farm for the next long time. I'm gonna go collect the mushrooms out of that cave. Beautiful. Just need mushrooms now. Need to sell them now. Hold on to those. That's everything I need planted, planted, right? Well, besides those two coffee seeds that, you know, fucking crows took out. You're gonna give me that comment again? No. It's not. Thank you, wife. Oh, they're planted. You just can't fucking see that they're planted. I'm selling this. Talk to the wizard. Talk to the wizard. Talk to the woman to keep her happy. No, oh, the elbow just fucking popped to hell. Well, at least I have something to do on stream until the fucking very end. Until the fucking bitter end. Summer is gonna be such a fucking shitty season for me. Yo, it's going, wizard. Trust you enough to. Wait. Yep, I've already been in. What the fuck is this thing? I'm. Nothing, really, I do nothing with this. I don't even mine it. It vaporizes your pickaxe when you go to hit something like a person. Like, if I were to go to hit these books next to them. Oh, never mind, the books. It lets me hit. What about that? What about the stool? Oh, yeah, it hit the stool too. What about the cauldron? No, you can see it vaporize from my hands, at, like, almost like it's going into the thing. And then the same with the table, and the chair. 
You can see it vanish in my fucking hands. Great design. I mean, it makes sense. What are you gonna let me do? Fucking beat shit with a fucking. Just gonna let me beat shit with a pickaxe for no reason? Is that in the arrowhead of the lake? I assume that means somewhere on the left. Hey, Elliot, what's up? I've been cutting some beautiful shells in front of my house. I'd imagine the rare varieties are quite available. <laughs> Gotta fucking do shit. What am I doing, Emily? Emily. Emily, that's what I'm doing. I'm talking to Emily. Let's fucking go. That's all I'm doing right now, I think, to my knowledge. Am I out of coffee? Yep. We're a woman. Wrong woman up there. I need the other woman with red. I need the other red woman. She home? Oh. Where does Emily go? It's Tuesday. Does that mean that it's like the fucking aerobics day for, um... There she is. Like I said, the other red woman. The red woman with the blue woman parts. I feel bad for Linus. People judge him, but he's living a different lifestyle. Wish everyone could learn to be accepting of others. Very true. The computer's yelling at me again. The fans are kicking up. Half an hour. Half an hour. Okay. What else do I do for today? That's what I could do. No, never mind. It's past five. I couldn't. I don't even know if that tapper is gonna do anything by the end of the season. <laughs> Been there for a while. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna sell this chicken. I need to go put shit away, and then tomorrow is more watering. Well, that's what goes in there. I have sunflower seeds to plant that I didn't fucking plant. God fucking damn it. Oh, looks like I got another addition to the top part of this. Beautiful. Now I guess I'm gonna have to water him like this from the center. Because I cannot reach him from the outside. Can I even reach that one from the outside? I'm pretty sure the silo still blocks me right there, yep. Shitty, barely full silo. What are you? I haven't scared off any crows yet. Good. You. None? Good. I mean, they've learned their place. Okay, so the things I need on me for tomorrow. I'm gonna talk to my wife again. Ready for bed soon? Turn on the electric blanket for us. Hell yeah. Thank you. I keep forgetting we have one of those. Um, so... Starts with copper. Sleep. Yep, I'm going to sleep. Very nice. Very, very nice. Talk to my wife. Thank you very much. I totally feed him. So you can't do it horizontally. You can't do it when you're going up and down vertically, or just going vertically, but you can do it horizontally. I fucked that. So bad. Probably change this goddamn fucking forsaken song. Back to overdrive. I'll take it. Uh, high energy is what I need right now. 
for the last push of stream, because I'm pretty sure by the time I finish watering these fucking plants, the stream's gonna be fucking ending. <laughs> no, it's not gonna take that fucking long. It takes me like a couple minutes. How the fuck? I'm upset. Okay, I'm watering properly so far. Two of my plants are gonna be offset from the rest by a day. By a fucking day. Because, yeah, it's the third, so it's only gonna be a day. It's already almost eight, and I'm like nearly halfway done. Out of water. Glad I'm right here. Takes that much time and water. My gold watering can fucking empties by the end. Okay. I wonder if there's like an ideal growing pattern. Because I'm definitely not fucking using it if it's a thing. I'm using anything but the ideal growing pattern. Then again, I'm on the river farm, so it makes sense. It's like the worst farm for actually farming. Oh, what do I have to do? I've got bars on me so I can go upgrade my hoe for next season. My cat's like locked in place because of the fucking plants. It can't walk over my crops, I'm pretty sure, because it doesn't want to ruin them. Oh, what do you want from me? Doja Cola. For a taco I'm making. Someone bring me one? No. If I'm getting a Doja Cola, it's from fishing, and I ain't fishing at this very moment. Got to take my goddamn shit to motherfucking Clint. I don't want a fucking- I don't need a trash can! Oh, okay, that's what it means. I get value from it. Okay. It means this trash can in my inventory. Which I guess is made of something worse than copper. I don't know what the base material of our tools are, if they're that bad. Maybe iron. Iron makes sense. How does the dungeons work? I know there's dungeons in this game that you're supposed to go through and shit, but like, I don't understand how that works. Is that like a skull cavern thing? Like a desert cavern? Oh yeah, wait, I gotta do foraging for this season because I haven't done it yet. There's a game. That's the game. There, um, in a kindergarten, that game where you murder children as a child, you um can climb the wall. And my brain keeps seeing pixelated game. That must mean that we can climb this brick wall. Or not brick wall, the like rock wall for the playground. It's been a long time since I've climbed a rock wall that was good enough a size to climb for a while. When you're tall, it's a little, just a tad bit difficult to climb things without just reaching the top of them in a fucking single reach. I can reach the top of the rock wall nowadays at Cove Point, the park. It's fucking wild. I don't know if there's forageable items here. Or how to get most of the summer forageable items. What are the four? I know pomegranate's one of them, right? No, that's crops, hold on. Wait, I finished the pantry. Never mind, I'm already done with that. Why am I foraging? I do need, I do need a pomegranate, though. Was there something else I needed that was forageable from the community center? Pomegranate. I think that's it. And the sunflower. I don't know how that... Oh, I'm growing sunflowers. That's how that works. Abigail took a life from mine. I'll never forget that. Ah, top 
It's a lot of butterflies. I'll water my cat real quick. Look at all that grass! Hell yeah. I'll leave the grass here for him. Because apparently the animals like having grass to eat. That's just natural grass. I'm shaving off the edges of the grass and not like the inner parts because the more of the inner parts there are, the like larger the surface area or the larger area in the center, the more grass is capable of growing. So if you cut the edges so that it still can grow, but it's got like room to grow, fuck, but it's still got room to grow. Like this can grow in every direction except like here. God damn it, I fucked it. But like still, you get my point. It'll grow more this way. It'll grow out in every direction and all that. So you want to trim the edges more than anything. It requires you to learn how to properly cut it without cutting way too much like I'm, I've been doing. I've been overcutting the grass just a tad. You don't want it to get too close to this grass though because I don't know if it grows on that grass. And if it does grow on that grass, oh, fuck. Yeah. Mine. Mine. Well, I guess chop is more appropriate of a word for wood. Mine is the word you use for rocks. Ah, it's green. Yeah, fun. Sorry. I don't know where I was about to go with that. I was about to say nothing. Nothing with a lot of words. That's what I say quite often. I use a very large vocabulary to get across a point of essentially no meaning. I can get a grass started, that's exactly what I wanted. Just in case, you know, I end up having cows down here. Ask- yeah, I was gonna- I don't know why that came to mind. Ask me if I'm a truck. Are you a truck? No! Fucking funniest shit on the planet. I can't walk through any of this. Alright, what else do I have to do? What time is it? 42? I still got some time left in the day. I can do some other things. What other things? I don't know. Some. I feel like there's something I need that I can for forage in the summer, but I don't know what. I can get grapes. I can- I can make grape jelly! There's something else I needed grapes for, though. I could have sworn. Someone liked grapes. Don't know who, but someone. Or maybe there's a recipe or something like that. Jam. I can make wine in a keg, which I don't have. Because I don't have pine tar, pine sap, pine stuff, whatever it is. What the fuck are you doing? You've been here a while now. Your farm must be thriving. Well, in this current season, yeah, it is fucking it's massive. They need to water these plants more. Am I perfectly maneuvered through those children? They were blocking my path and I went right past them. But I can't forage from any of that. A lot of trash in the water. Tuna is going to an unsustainable level and the local angler to help reduce their numbers. And my friend, we were on the car, and I said, want to hear something crazy? And then we all started saying, yeah, that sounds about right. Crazy, I was crazy once. They locked me in a room, a rubber room, a rubber room with rats. So that's me, crazy. And it just repeats infinitely in a car. Several people saying it at once makes it even worse to some people. I find the community bond of it quite great. I'm pretty sure I got the bear statue in another playthrough. I think I did. And I placed it back here because I realized I never fucking went back here. I, like, never go near the Jojo Mart. Join us. Thrive. Go fuck yourself. Membership is now available. The Jojo membership will be able to make improvements in the community with the help of our dedicated personnel for fee, of course. Oh, and another thing. Mayor Lewis promised us that if anyone else joined up, he'd let us turn that old community center to a Jojo warehouse. Isn't that wonderful? 
Kill yourself. Sorry. Felt bad for their mom. Is this cheaper? This looks more expensive. Right? Isn't it? I mean, I guess it doesn't really fucking matter. I think this was like 50, so maybe not. Can I speak to you? She doesn't talk while on the clock, I guess. Damn. Commitment. Those bricks? They still them bricks? Damn. Hold on. Should I, I'm gonna go Google something. Should I join Jojo Mart? Hold on. Is it worth it? Would it be better for a second, third, or further playthrough where players want to get the rewards unlocked earlier? Completing the Jojo Mart rewards will gain you a vending machine. This will produce a singular can of Jojo Cola every day. What happens if you join it? Jojo Mart. In the Jojo Mart, Jojo Mart route, you just buy these upgrades. What upgrades? In defense of the Jojo Mart. Is Pierre or Jojo Mart better? Pierre is often considered the better option, but Joja has a few things on sale worth picking up. The world of Stardew Valley it seems almost endless with so many different options, blah, blah, blah. Don't give a fuck. How do I get rid of Joja? Okay. So if you decide to complete the community route, you'll need to restore it. If you decide to go with the community center route, you'll need to restore it completely by donating all the materials necessary to complete the bundles. After this, the Joja Mart will close for good. Good. Who is the girl in Joja Mart? Claire lives in the countryside outside of Pelican Town and buses in to work as a cashier at Jojo Mart. Initially quiet and reserved, but she has big dreams for a life beyond retail. So I'm assuming when you close down Jojo Mart by taking the path that I'm going right now, you end up giving her a better life than what she has. She's a shit life. What do I need? Well, it's like the important things I need. Animal. All those things. I'm growing all those things. I'm growing all those things. I, I, I'm I, working on that right now, actually. I have that. That'll be like the final thing I give. I can make that because I have grapes, but I need a keg, which means that I need two of this. Uh, I can get that eventually. I don't remember where you get the pomegranate. Um, wheat. Apple. I'm, I have an apple tree, I think. And I just need... I'm growing wheat, actually, so that works fine. Maple syrup. Uh, doable. 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 Oh yeah, I need pigs for that. That's doable. That requires literally just an egg and oil, I'm pretty sure. Very doable. Again, requires me to get ducks. I'm growing both of these. So I'm essentially done with the fucking game. I have so little left but to wait to do things. God, I'm so fucking far along. It's amazing. Fucking great. I'm loving how close to the end of this game I am. With how long of a game it is, and it means I can move on! Then again, I gotta move on in the third year. So I'm probably gonna spend all of the second- all of the third year? He said he'll come back at the- wait, no. He said he comes back on the dawn of the third year, didn't he? Hold on. I gotta go Google something. And... And Grandpa... Re-evaluate the farm. The player can re-evaluate at any time by placing a diamond in the grandpa shrine. Hmm. So, at the end of this year, grandpa will evaluate my farm. But, if I have all the objectives done any point after that, by any amount... I can just have him reevaluate it with a diamond, which I have being infinitely produced. Actually, I don't have the diamond thing producing diamonds right now. I don't even know if I have it down, honestly. I don't have a fucking... I don't have my fucking hoe. It's been given to somebody. Wife. My beautiful wife. I used to be a night owl, but I'm just... I'm starting to enjoy the rhythm of life on the farm. It feels natural. Yeah. Giving my wife a better life. Pet my cat. I already have. I'm gonna hit sleep right at the end of the day. Right as the day ends. Well, right as I hit 2 hours and 50. And then I have 10 minutes to completely wind it down. Ah. Oh. Oh.
where these are all fine what damage was caused it doesn't look like there's anything different that motherfucker They didn't just strike my fucking farm again! I don't even have my fucking hoe. I can't even fix that because my hoe's in the fucking repair. They're not in the- it's being fucking upgraded. Oh wait, it doesn't even fucking matter because I'm ending the day. I just wanted to see what else there was. What's my wife gonna say today? What do you got for me? Make sure you don't get a heat stroke my- it's fucking storming! Drink plenty of water and don't overwork yourself. Thank you. Okay, well. Done, done. Everything's done. Everything's done. Now I gotta extend the stream for another eight minutes, roughly eight and a half minutes. Really not like it's difficult if I can find something to talk about, which is a little difficult. Can't think of anything, surprisingly. One of those it's one of those times where I'm so stressed about wanting to talk about something that I just talk about not being able to talk about anything. I can talk about fucking Pikachu. Pikachu, I keep losing the fucking... Because I just set him down somewhere after stream is over. Or like, throw him somewhere, leave him wherever he ended up. And then I just forget where that was and have to look for him before I throw him again. Oh, another thing I could talk about. That whole Karambit business thing. The little practice thing. This, this thing, it's got a dull tip. It's not real. It's a toy, essentially. I've showed it off plenty of times. Yeah, no, I've been practicing a lot with it, and I'm slowly getting better. It's just, you know, a little hard to throw, put, like, actual flair into it, because the knife tricks are so simple with it. It doesn't have much flair. It has flair if you don't know how it works. But as soon as you know how it works, it's just, it loses most of its impressive, most of the impressiveness that it had. Because you can see exactly how everything works, and it's all revolving around the same simple principle of spin it and keep it spinning, and you're doing great. Like, it's literally all it is. Sure, it's impressive to be able to hold it for a while, but you there's not so much that you can do other than, like, the figure eight. No, the figure eight, is it's literally just this. You literally just flick your wrist around. But, like, it makes it seem so much cooler than it is if nobody knows what you're doing. It's such a simple skill that requires basic motor functions, essentially. And yet, it just seems so much cooler than it is. Doing it, it's just, like, painful and tiring. Honestly, it's starting to lead to bigger forearms on my part because that fucking thing takes so much energy after like 10 minutes of spinning it. One difficult thing, though, that I'm trying to teach myself to do is to spin it to a beat in like a song or some shit, like something generally fast to try to speed up how fast I can do it. I have like actual goals. Like if you know the song Rush E, that piano song made by like, I think it was Sheet Music Boss or something like that. Yeah, I think it was Sheet Music Boss. Um, it's insane. It's very fast towards the end. Sure, you can't match every single key press on the piano because, you know, obviously. But you can match most of them if you can keep yourself moving long enough. Because you've got to switch between... In order to hit every beat of Rush E, you have to spin this, like, multiple times per second. Which, you know, you can see that I'm doing because you can see it rotating around my finger. But you have to do that, and then, in order to make it look good, you also have to spin it in other ways to flare up each beat change, because there's a lot of those. It's fucking, it's a process to learn. It's also, again, it's just not as impressive as it really looks like it could be. It's just basic motor functions. Sure, I haven't dropped it that much yet. I usually drop it a lot more. You know, like that. Honestly, I don't even know if you could see that it dropped there. I might have just given it away. It's just such a simple thing to do. Like, sure, it's good for fidgeting around with, because if you do it slower, your chances of dropping it kind of go down the drain. But it's just, there's not much to it. I guess there's, like, certain parts to it, like, if you can spin it over your palm or some shit, which I don't know how possible that is. Well, I haven't tried it. It's very difficult. That's what it is. Because you have to bend your finger like this while keeping... You have to have your finger bent in while having it strong enough to support the weight of a karambit around it. While vertical. And it's not super fucking easy. This is, this is what I spend the last bit of my stream on. Goddamn.
completely unrelated to anything that I'm doing, but it's the end, so. Okay, there we go, fucking Pikachu. All point in a fucking Karambit is to be able to slit arteries and shit, I believe. Like, because it can slice open a leg really easily because of the curved blade. It goes right around the neck at the right parts if you want it to cut that. It's meant to slice arteries open with its shape. And yet here I am. And then here most people are in the modern day using it to spin. Pretty sure Karambits are actually outlawed in most, like, warfare because they fucking, they cut arteries. Why wouldn't they be? Yeah, this is nowhere near as difficult as it looks. It's literally just going around my finger. Sure, it takes some practice, but that's all it takes. It takes, like, do it. Do it a lot and you're done. And all it is, is with this one, it's literally just stick my middle finger out. It stops. Flick it around again. Put my middle finger back out. Stop it. Like, you just redirect it with your other fingers behind the scenes. And it just doesn't. It's nowhere near as much as it seems. And you don't even have to stick your, like, middle finger. You can use your thumb. You can bounce it off of your thumb this way. So just stick my thumb out. And then it just goes back around. Sure, it's more difficult to go back with my thumb, but... It's so fucking simple. You just move your fingers. You move your fingers and move your wrist to keep it spinning. Or move your, like, elbow. Your wrist, fingers, and elbow. It is literally just those things. You don't have to use, like, any of your bicep for it. Your elbow can just not leave the fucking ground that you're doing it on the entire time. And it'll work perfectly. I mean, sure, it'll look dumber, but it'll still be going around. There's not much you need elbow work for, at least not in the basics or anything super advanced. I mean, even fingers, like finger spinning, it's literally just you flick it forward, you connect your thumb to your index finger, you have it on your index finger, you flick it this way, and then you connect your fingers while it's around here. You connect these two fingers, and then it just goes to the other. And then you just do that both ways. So I can just go from here. It just requires you to spin it right so that the momentum carries it over based on the position of your fingers and how it has to go over. Because you spin it counterclockwise, that way it has this downward force here. Pretty sure you can even do it the other way if you try hard enough. It just requires you to figure out how. No, it does end up doing that every time. So it goes yeah, clockwise to get it onto your thumb, counter onto that, and it's so fucking easy to spin them between each other. Just requires like the tiniest bit of effort. I mean, you can even do it onto your other fingers. Once it's onto your thumb, it can go over to any other finger. I can fucking wrap it around my middle finger. If I get it on my pinky, I can put it on my fucking pinky. And then move it right back via that. Sure, it doesn't look that impressive because it's my fucking pinky. I have a little practice doing it. Pinky. Index. Pinky. It's so simple. It's just basic like spatial awareness and finger dexterity i got the fucking finger trick down almost immediately because it really doesn't take that much practice none of it did sure this hurts because of like this little grip part right here that's jamming into my middle finger to stop it and this thing bashing into my thumb so i guess it takes the sacrifice of your finger health that's about it though other than that, it's rather simple. It's so, f it's so easy to get moving. Throwing Pikachu time? Yeah, in like a minute. Not even. Be patient. Gone. I threw it. My fingers are red. My pinky hurts. Can't really show it off because it's most of my finger. Actually, right here, you can probably see a slight difference. No, not on camera. There's a very slight redness to my middle finger around the base of it, right here, around the base of the knuckle, compared to my other fingers. My thumb, barely messed up. It's a little dented. That's about it. I guess it hurts a bit too, but it's rather simple. All right, now it's throwing Pikachu tap. Just look at the wall, and then pull back. That was shit. I'm throwing it again. I was looking at my mic while I threw it, and I, you can actually... You can actually hear it. There you go. I threw it. And now stream ends. So, like, you know, you know, you know how it goes. You know, you know the routine.